Digital Bay. to the program. <laughs> talking about There's a lot of white people in here. <laughs> Last time in front of a lot of white people like this, I had to prove I wasn't guilty. I'm <laughs> <laughs> real nervous right now. Especially in front of my man right there for <laughs> Look real important. Man. <laughs> I hope I make it out of here, see. <laughs> All right. Talk about something real slick here. I don't know. I'm having trouble with this mic. I don't know. Y'all help me out, no, because I don't know if I'm institutionalized or paralyzed or just high. <laughs> but I uh, recently got released off probation. Let me talk to y'all about when I went to jail. Because I want y'all to help me out. Does this mean a person is gay? Like, when we go to jail, right, everybody has to shower together. Ain't no showering alone. All that shit in. Once you put your feet on the orange footprint, all that shit in. You got to be in the prison no the orange footprint. Notice only the black people laugh over there. We've been there. So, once you put your foot again on the orange footprint, it's all in, showered in. So, now, fellas, help me out. So now I'm in the shower, you can tell pretty much everybody's character. Because you got one person in there watching up like this. <laughs> and then you got one person watching up like this. <laughs> then you got another person watching like this. <laughs> so now what I'm doing, what I read my question. So when I come in the shower and I see, and don't get me wrong, because that myth about the black guys all over. But this was a white dude. So he come in the shower. <laughs> you won't be in that shower right there long. I said, look here, man. I'm going to tell you like this here. <laughs> That's when I found out I was going to be a comedian. <laughs> because it's real hard to stay hard and keep an erection and laugh at the same time. Can you imagine a person keeping an erection and fell? Just imagine, I mean, you, you all the way there fixed. You got it there, right? And all of a sudden, someone makes you laugh. You're going to go from. <laughs> so you, that's, what I, that's when I knew I was going to be a comedian, though. I, I kept them laughing. That kept their mind off the ass. And I also, I also hear voices every now and then. And the voices are always around the police. I was in the cell with one guy, and I was talking to him, and I was like, man, what are you, what are you in here for? He said, uh, they said I was uh, something sexually with some people, and I don't know the word, I think the word was pedophile or something like that. So, soon as he told me that, I went to knocking on the door, guard, guard! <laughs> you know this dude, the pedophile? He said, don't worry about it, you're over 21, aren't you? I said, oh, hey, oh, okay, oh. All right, well, I'm cool with it, all right? But anyway, uh, I'm riding down Gettysburg, right? I'm trying to find me some new whores, right? You know, while I'm driving now, I be booty watching too while I'm driving. <laughs> so anyway, I'm riding down Gettysburg. I see this broad, I pick her up, right? She get in, so I tell her, you know, I'm something like a pimp. I'm a pimp's friend. I'm a son of a pimp. So she gets in, I explain to her, I tell her, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna put you to work, baby. We're gonna get this money together. You know, we're gonna work like weather. You rain, I snow. Other than that, we're gonna make earthquake. So once I put all that in her ear, right? I tell her all that. So we can, we pull over to the back. I gotta try out to make sure she knows what she's doing, right? So I slide her ten dollars. We gotta get in the character. I slide her ten dollars. So we're in the back seat, we having sex, right? I'm beating it up too, right? I'm tearing it up, right? But I wanted to impress her. So I took two of my actors. Now the first one, it did what it was supposed to be, it ran its course, it got down where it was supposed to be. I call him Richard, you can call him Dick. But it got down there where it's supposed to be, right? So the other one got caught in my throat, and I got a stiff neck. 
<laughs> Still having trouble to swallow. But anyway, so we ain't scared. I'm beating it up, right? So after I get done, I dust myself off, get myself together, I get. And I realize, hold on, wait a minute. I said, oh, hold on, girl, girl you done gave me the crap. She said, what you expect for $10, nigga? Shrimp? <laughs> I said, I meant grow. I meant grow. We always go together. Let's do better. Hey, the audience, you guys look good in this mirror. Oh, I might be able to tell you. I said, ask my wife how I'm going to get through this five minutes. She said, just think of sex. That's what I mean. She said, it only take two minutes for that, so why the hell you couldn't do five minutes? <laughs> but anyway, I'm going to get off the stage. I've seen the lights, and if I start talking again, I right, keep it going. How much seconds I got? Do I got enough to about a couple more seconds or is it over? <laughs> couple more seconds? Okay, listen. <laughs> Check this out. I, I explained this to them because I got I got some white friends. And I had to explain because they came home and they were wondering what I was doing in their house. What I what you doing? They wonder what I'm doing in their house. So I had broke in. So when I see them, I'm panicking, right? I don't know what to do. So when I see them, I just said, I, I, I'm panicking, right? So I, 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 Oh, <laughs> 